635 is your time as Colorado lawmakers get ready to get back to work today. Several of the new lawmakers are breaking diversity barriers. Denver 7's Micah Smith joins us with how they hope to go beyond just the election, Micah, and enact change. Brian, Colorado Democrats now have the most diverse caucus in caucus history. Over this past year, you've probably heard the term representation matters quite a few times. And I talked to two new lawmakers who say that can't just be a phrase. Representative elect Jennifer Bacon of Northeast Denver told me representation should translate into tangible change. What's really important is to not just hear the voices of our neighbors, but to also hold ourselves accountable to seeing that what they have asked for or demanded actually comes into fruition. Bacon says she plans to do this by inviting her constituents into spaces where decisions are made. She said she did this as a member of the Denver School Board and cited the removal of police officers from Denver Public Schools as an example of listening to those she serves and confronting an issue. I also talked to the first Muslim lawmaker ever elected in our state, Iman Judah, who represents Aurora. She broke down for me what she plans to do from day one. Advocate be unapologetic for who I am and make sure that, again, marginalized communities, communities that have been traditionally underrepresented, have a voice. Judah says she also wants to make sure any legislation she sponsors has little to no fiscal note or price tag so that the state budget can remain focused on COVID relief and recovery. Judah and Bacon say not only do they expect big things from themselves, but they plan to hold their colleagues accountable and hold true to the ideal that all people are created equal. Brian.